I'm Nina Angelovska from Macedonia, from the Macedonian e-commerce association. It was a pleasure to be here at the uh, uh, e-commerce week. And this year we had the pleasure to participate in the first global meeting of e-commerce associations. And I have uh, the pleasure to uh, make this video of uh, all of us, where we share where we are from and what is the biggest challenge in our country. Hi, I'm Min Kuntirat Pakwat Kailud. Like I'm a Thailand delegation that um, we are here in Antat e-commerce week. Hi, this is uh, Sohel. I'm from uh, Bangladesh e-commerce alliance. Oh, hi everybody, my name is Caio, I'm from e-commerce Brazil. My name is Marcel Weiss and I'm the president of e-commerce Croatia Association. Hello, I'm Alistair Tempest, I'm from the e-commerce Forum Africa. Hello everybody, my name is Igor Zulov and I represent Russian e-commerce Association. Hello, my name is Aaron Miller, and I'm co-founder of the e-commerce association. facing now uh, is the, the relationship with government and the lack of regulation in e-commerce. The challenges that we facing is about like applications because all the pro are people they know about e-commerce and uh, the older, the ages, they know everything but what about the smaller one? So they know only gaming, they know how to use like app, and iPad but they don't know how to utilize this as like the greatest great, uh, great thing of internet. The challenges that we are facing, one of the major challenges is the payment system and the another one is logistic. So these are the two major challenges that we are facing. The third one would be access to finance. The biggest issue for our members is how to sell cross-border, meaning the big shipment costs and of course the language barriers and uh, everything else that bothers every every other country in our region. And infrastructure and languages, telecoms and the cost of telecoms, data, um, it includes uh, roads and structures like that and it includes uh, customs for cross border. One of the biggest challenges of e-commerce in Serbia is general population uh, awareness rising about online shopping and secure shopping. And also on the human capacity is going to lead to this e-commerce growth. The main challenge which we face today in Russia is very bad efficient logistic infrastructure. Therefore, unfortunately, we have very high logistic costs and very long delivery time for e-commerce passes. So the biggest challenge in Macedonia is the low level of digital skills. So we will be mainly focused, our projects will be focused on educating the companies as well as, as, well as the population. We intend to increase the capacities of the existing companies, engage more companies in e-commerce, open up their, this new channel for them. And uh, then we also, of course, will work on educating uh, the population. Thank you very much.